Thank you, Jesus. The Holy Ghost has spoken to pray over leadership, leadership of churches, leadership of Hallelujah, of Bible classes, of small groups, of, of outreach ministries. I am speaking over you now. Focus, leaders, focus like never before. Do not try to fashion your ministry to fit the wants and the desires of the heathen, the wants and the desires of the world. God says, I need you to remember my blueprint. I need you to remember what I have said, what I have set up, why I called you, why I anointed you, why I appointed you. Please do not be distracted by their naysays. Do not be distracted by what they have said behind your back, what they have written, what they have blogged, what they have said. But God says, focus on what I have given you. You will need to be strong in these last days. You will need to rise up. You will need to rise up. I am speaking to those that are marching to my beat. Marching to my beat. But many of you are not marching to my beat. You have gotten off and you are in another place. You have lost the cadence. March to my beat. I speak to the leader. Then he's a march to my beat. If you will only hear the sound, if you will only hear the sound, I am calling you to a higher Hakamo standard. You are not to follow those that are doing everything. You are not to follow those that look like they are grabbing more sheep due to their trends and their gimmicks. But God says, I need some followers that are real. I need some people that are serious. I need a leader that will study. I need a leader that will follow. I need a leader, not someone that's the face, the face of a pulpit. Not some guy or woman with dynamics. Not somebody that makes people excited. But do they change? Do they transform? Because my word did not always excite. Check it out in the Bible. God says, I did not always excite, but I changed. I made hearts convicted. I made hearts think. I made hearts question. I am not here to excite. I am here to transform. I am not here. I am not in your churches to just ignite a motivation. Oh, but I am in your churches to motivate a holiness. If the leader was just right, if the leader was just right, if the leader could just focus, if the leader could just strip, if the leader could just fast, if the leader could just pray, if the leader could just live holy, if the leader could just cut off the junk on their television, oh, if the leader could just stop listening to secular music, if the leader could just focus, if the leader could just hear me. But leaders don't listen to me anymore. They listen to the sound of their own march.